Hello and welcome. I'm Professor Lucas, and I'm here to help you with all your reading, writing, and studying challenges with clear, helpful, and focused videos. Today, we're taking a quick look at how to create an MLA formatted header in Microsoft Word. When you first open a Microsoft Word document, you should see something like this. I'm using Microsoft Word 360, but the interface is identical in most fairly recent versions. In order to create an MLA formatted header, the first thing we need to do is access the header section. You cannot simply type the header on the main part of the page. There are two ways to access the header. The first is the simplest. Simply double-click in the area of the header to make it appear. You can see that light gray lines showing the header and the footer areas appear once you have access. To get out again, you can click the big red X or simply double-click the main body of the paper. The other way to access the header and footer is to go to the Insert menu, select Header, and then scroll down to the bottom of the drop-down menu, selecting Edit Header. Notice your cursor blinking in the header, indicating you've gotten in successfully. Now, MLA requires you have your last name and the page number right aligned in the header. First, we need to get the cursor over on the right so the text will be on the correct side. In order to do that, click the Home menu table, and then click the Right Align button. The first element of your header is your last name, so you simply type it in. My last name is Lucas, so I will type that in. Then, you hit the space bar one time, and it's time to add the page number. However, you want to avoid the common blunder of just typing in the number, as that number will appear on every page, and the last thing we want is for every page to say that it's page 1. Instead, we want to use the menu to insert the page number, so we need to go back to the header and footer menu by clicking on the title here. Then, we will go to the Page Number tool over here on the left, click it, selecting Current Position, and Plain Number. This means that as you add pages, the page numbers will automatically be correct. The second page will say Page 2, the third page will say Page 3, and so on. Congratulations! Now you have an MLA header! Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it or found it helpful, and comment below if you have any questions or anything you'd like me to make a guide on. I'm here to help. All the topics I discuss on my channel and more are discussed in my textbook, College Composition and Reading, Information and Strategies, which I've linked below in the description box. I encourage you to check it out. Thanks for watching. Bye!